So walking around in Punta Arenas today, waiting for our information sessions uh, this evening, waiting to hear about Antarctica tomorrow, I found all these murals, large murals on walls. And um, yeah, they're, they're very intriguing. Uh, they're, they're great to look at. And I immediately started wondering what the stories are behind these, who the artists are, why there are so many murals on the streets, and uh, why this woman is crying in the window. There's a boy sitting here, looks like he's studying. Uh, maybe he didn't get to go to school or something happened. Or maybe he is going, leaving for college or something like that. Uh, but you can see the wall here. Uh, this is the pavement and uh, the layer of paint behind the murals showing here. So this is one of them. Here's another one. Very large, big wall. You can actually see my suitcase here. I was dragging it from one hotel to another hotel because uh, that's what I had to do. And uh, on the way I admired these murals. I wonder who this general is. I've asked around again uh, here at the hotel, local Punta Arenas people, and they don't know really anything about these. They say, well, yeah, they're just mules. They don't know what the stories are, but you can see it's all about the maritime nature of this place. Here's another one. Isn't it great? That's the wall. This house looks like a ship. I wonder if there is a house like that around here. I haven't seen any architecture to suggest this might exist. You can see how the wind is blowing and uh, the bag is flowing with the wind. It's cold as it is always here close to Antarctica. And this is a cool one here. You can see that the brick is exposed. This is actual exposed brick. But down here, they've actually painted exposed brick. So they're making use of a uh, the natural feature there. Oh, I didn't notice that before. There's a video camera, CCTV. Hope you enjoyed the murals.